gotten to the end zone. Bailey now to kick it away after the touchdown. This fielded a few yards into the end zone. And he'll be brought down at the 23, make it the 24-yard line. Falcons now come up first and 10 at their own 24. They'll try and run for the first time with Freeman. And he goes nowhere. He'll lose yardage back at the 17. They'll wind up losing seven yards on the play. And it'll be a second and long. Here's Ryan. A fight for the football and it's intercepted. Picked off by the linebacker, Kyle Van Noy. And his guys will take over at the 25-yard line. Now, oh, Brandon, this is a veteran quarterback back there. He should know better than to make a throw like this. This is definitely not his best ball. And I think he knew this was trouble the second it was leaving his hand. Let's go, let's go. First down, here's Wright. This will be stopped about two yards shy of the marker. Eight-yard gain, second and two. Pretty effective run there, and now they can start to smell that end zone. Pound the rock. Make sure you use your O-line to set the tone of dominance and physicality, and pound the rock. From the 17, Brady caught by the tight end Watson. And he'll go down here at the 12-yard line. A gain of five, good enough for the first down. That's a staple of this offense, drag route to the tight end. Yeah, he's only able to use his size to break off much more yardage after the catch, but still an effective gain nonetheless. And they'll get him down after a pickup of eight, second and two. If these kinds of lanes are available, you have to feel like he's going to have a pretty big game on the ground. Yeah, you can tell early on he's got a little burst in his step, and that's a big pickup right there on first down. They'll come out in the pistol. On second down, they'll run with White, and that one blown up quickly as he's going to be stopped before he can even get started. Give him a loss of six yards, and it brings up third down. Throwing is Brady on third down. As a man, and it's Edelman for the Patriot touchdown. Tom Brady with two first quarter touchdown passes. And the Patriots, they add on to their lead. Now four bath for the extra point. And it's good to make it 14-0. 14-0 the score. This is the NFL on EA Sports. The kickoff unit is out on the field, and they will send this one away. Come on, baby. Let's go. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes a pretty important drive, doesn't it? It certainly does, and a lot of the teams script plays. We know that, right? They, they have a script to start the ball game, and typically those scripts go between 12 and 24, 25 plays. Down two touchdowns early, probably not very deep into their script. I think that they'll stay with it. I don't think they'll abandon it just yet and try and generate some offense on this drive. Anything, at least three points get that zero off the board and brought down but not before reaching the 45 yard line 15 yards first down atlanta on the heels of that good carry by Devonte freeman here's first and 10 
protein spill. They just do get the playoff as he'll look to throw. Aaron it out, looking for Ridley. A 50-50 ball here, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Stephon Gilmore. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. So that's back-to-back -back drives where they've thrown an interception. Ordinarily, we look at the offense and say, what's going on with your scheme? Maybe we should look at the defense and just give them a whole lot of credit. They've got them frustrated right now. The Pats at the line, ready to go. go it's been a good first half defense. so far. They're up 14 to nothing. Points here that could really put them in command before intermission. Yeah, and it's all well and good what they're seeing and how they're feeling right now. But this is the NFL. How many times have we watched 14 to nothing leads evaporate and quickly? Mm. So how have, we, how have we seen them combat it? Continue to run your offense, but don't back off at all. Don't start looking at the clock. Don't start thinking about, hey, just take care of the football. Keep attacking, usually the best way to maintain control. On first down, White. The Vic Beasley able to make the tackle. I call that play a success. A nice inside run sets up a very manageable second down, a very solid gain on that play. The run got four, now they deal with a second and six. Brady gives this to White. Call it a gain of a yard, and it's going to bring up third and five. The passing game's been working quite well so far, but the running game's been a little bit of a struggle, and that's a surprise to me. Typically, when you can throw it, you've opened up lanes for your runners. Brady. Two minutes to play, first half, it's 14 to nothing. And he's unable to haul it in, so it falls incomplete over the middle third of the field, and that brings up fourth. Fans, a reminder, I have a note card here that says ad-lib halftime preview. So I guess let's do just that as we'll hand things over to Jonathan Coachman in Orlando when this one reaches halftime. Did I do okay? You did great. Not a bad job. Hey, but, you know, writing down your ad If you print it, I'm going to read it. I'm Brandon Gauden. First down at the 35-yard line. Brady now. Only one pass has hit the ground for him. 10 of 11 thus far. It's first and 10. To throw is Brady. It's caught. This is right. Call it a pickup of seven. And it'll bring up a second down. And just in general, Charles, on a play like that, how tough is it for the defense to account for a running back essentially being a receiver downfield? It's very difficult, especially if the running back has skills like a receiver, and you're aware of that before the game even begins. So throughout your practice sessions, you're going to want to be aware of him. Where is he lining up? What can he do? What kind of damage can he do to us downfield? And who can match up with him without weakening our overall defense? You're exactly right. It's a tough task to match up to him. That goes as a gain of 11 and a Patriot first down. First down. First down. Let's go, They'll run on first down. White. And he'll get seven yards from the 17 to the 10 before he's taken down. Well, no matter how they phrase it, staying on schedule, staying ahead of the sticks, whatever you want to call it, seven yards on first down. That fits the bill. On second down now, it's White. And this won't be enough to pick up the first. A gain of two, third and one. They go play action for White. Now it's Brady. Incomplete. He had his hands on it, but couldn't pick it. But it's now fourth down. Results in a fourth down. They converted once earlier in this drive, but they'll roll the dice here again on fourth down. Brady going to go on fourth down. The quick slap caught. 
And he'll take it into the end zone for a Patriot touchdown. Tom Brady, his third touchdown pass of this first half. And the Patriots, they add on to their lead. Forbath to add the extra point. And it is now 21 to nothing. Bailey now to kick it away after the touchdown. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. And some dangerous territory. You're already down three scores. A three and out here or an inability to put any points up. This one might be over by half. Yeah, and what you also have to guard against is calling every play for a big shot downfield. You know, thinking you're going to get all these points back. I'm not saying you have ultimate patience here, but you also don't have to go ahead and force everything either. And this should be the final play before the quarter ends. Check, check. Check, check. Hey, Sam. Check, 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 check. 51 the mic, boy. 51. Hey, hey, here, here I come. Final play of the half. It's Ryan. And it's hauled in by Austin Hooper. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the...